People tell jokes all the time, but only the great ones discover the art of telling a joke. They can mesmerize a crowd like a snake charmer. Life is truly funny like that. I've brought you some of the funniest people in the game today. Now I want to show you a side of these comedians that you've never seen before. I'm Bob Sumner, and welcome to Beyond the Jokes. Beyond the Jokes, where you can catch up with your most memorable and loved comedians, get up close and personal, and share some of these untold stories of obstacles and triumphs. Uncle Bob is in the driver's seat, taking you on an incredible journey of the glory days of Def Comedy Jam and life after such a huge phenomenon. Who was the original MC? of the Kings of Comedy. It was just me, Cedric, and, uh, and Bernie. I left the two because I wanted to get better. I said, I, I, need, I need that grind. I need to go in these clubs and the gym and get my act better. Both Bob and a special guest share personal stories, history-making moments, and show what made them so special in the first place. When Def Jam hit and when I came on TV, I, re I remember vividly, I, I would be outside and somebody would be like, hey, and I'll run because I didn't know if I stuck him up or if he wanted an autograph. <laughs> okay. Beyond the Jokes is Def Comedy Jam meets inside the actor's studio. You have a sit down with Uncle Bob as he interviews comedians of the past generation as well as the next generation of upcoming comics. Ladies and gentlemen, Tony Rock. First of all, Big Brother does everything first. When people think it's weird that I do comedy, it's like Big Brother had sex first, so should I right. not get pussy because he did it first? <laughs> right. Big Brother had a job first. Should I not want to work because he... I loved comedy, he loved comedy. Big Brother does everything first. Right. So that's, it, doesn't, it doesn't seem that weird to me. Who else better to tell these awesome and incredible stories other than the Godfather himself? Each half hour episode showcases a special guest. He'll take you back to the early days of their stardom from Def Comedy Jam to sold out comedy tours and what's next in their legendary careers. The likes of many careers he made happen. And I've always tried to work hard to make Bob proud of the fact that he chose me to do Def Comedy Jam. Put me on the map, believed in me, trusted. And that's all you really want, somebody to believe in you. And that's what he always did. Our love for comedy is just Beyond, beyond the joke. <laughs> That's exactly what it was. And I could sit and talk stand up, especially to Bob, someone who knows stand up forever. He's seen him, he's seen them all. It's much love to him, man. I'm quite sure this is gonna be one of the hottest shows ever.